tragedy can color a city. In Orlando, messages, paintings, and murals nudged us towards healing. It resonates, it resonates with everybody, or it resonates and you see, and it also wakes you up. The strokes remind us, pull from us, help us sort through our emotions. Because it takes time, you know, right after Pulse, we felt a certain way, we were angry, we were, we wanted to paint, you know. As the love and certain things start to resonate, as wisdom prevails over our frustrations, as artists, we incorporate. So that's why our murals are living murals. Some murals are ever-changing, like Michael Pilato and Yuri Karabash's piece in Thornton Park. The 49 victims, which none of them are done, you know. They're not done until, until we feel that the families feel that they're done, you know what I mean? Chris Junkie knows. He owns I Fix Your Eye, the business with the famous 49 rainbow birds. This is about love and it's about uh, remembering. Colorful souls taken on a gray night. That's what this reminds me of, is, is we have to love each other. And that's, that's what it's about. It's about L-O-V-E, love like the 49 orange blossoms on Einstein's bagels, and the hashtag on the center, and the hearts all over. The murals served as a, a way of helping heal, helping bring people together, helping you know share the love and, and, and really push people to push hate out. Because with each stroke, we show Orlando's true colors, colors of love, acceptance, and healing. In Orlando, I'm Erin Murray, Spectrum, News 13.